Jennifer here. Welcome back to my channel. I received this beautiful box in the mail from Crafty Me Shop. Thank you, Esme. She sent me uh, my design team package. And this is so pretty. I, I do love this picture of this lady here on the front. And it is a an image that she attached to the front of this box. And then tied it in with this seam binding. So I can't wait to dive in. See what we've got. How exciting. So if you don't know who Crafty Me Shop is, then you can check her out on Facebook. I'll leave the link to her shop below. She sells very beautiful appliques and um, laces. Look at this. How beautiful. Oh my gosh, this thing is jam-packed the first thing i notice are these cute little flowers oh my goodness that is really cute that's not my um i don't work with peach that much but these are really cute super adorable oh there's another one super cute those are really adorable put those off to the side and then omg look at this oh my gosh that is stunning wow look at that gorgeous it is like all seed beads some sequins Oh my gosh, and rhinestones on the flower. That is stunning, Esme. Wow. Gorgeous. Unbelievable. I love that. Woo! That's got to go on like a really special project. Oh yeah, I love these. This looks like she hand dyed this one. Super pretty. I love the um, beads on these. On the rhinestones and uh, you can cut these into different pieces so pretty oh my goodness look at that wow that is a lot oh I thought that was the wrong side there we go that is beautiful I love the dangle on that little dangles on that a lot of times to get that to go straight, I just kind of wet it a little bit. And then it usually dries straight after that. That's pretty. That would look really pretty um, tea dyed, I think. Gorgeous. Beautiful lace. Okay. And then look at this one. This is like a... This is a really pretty like salmon color. I kind of like it. Super pretty dangles. Dingles. She calls them dingles. <laughs> so cute. Okay, I love that. I love that color like with pink too. Let's see what else do we have here. Oh, that's pretty. I love cutting these apart and using little bits of the lace too. You don't have to use it just like it is. Take that off. So that's a really pretty lace. This looks very fall-ish, you know? Wow, this is another color that would is not one that I would normally use, but it is really pretty. It's coming across more green, but it's actually like a brownie bronze. It's kind of pretty. And you can cut those little medallions and use those separately. Pretty. Oh, I like the look of this. It's got like a pretty gold sheen to it. 
Oh, that's really cool. I like that with the, um, this almost looks like a taupe color. Really cool looking. I like that with the salmon. Okay, let's see. Oh, look at that. That is so unique. Esme has the coolest, most unique applique I think I've seen. Really pretty. I love the beading in that. And you can just like use bits of this, you know what I mean? You don't even have to use the whole thing. Just little accents on your project. Oh, look at this, this one in brown. I haven't seen this one in brown. That's like a mocha kind of color. It's coming across a little bit green, but it is like a mocha brown, very pretty. Again, I really like it with that salmon color there. So pretty. And then here's another one just like that. I love the beading in the center of the flowers. So pretty. Oh, look at this. Oh my goodness. This looks like a blush pink. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Look at the beading. Sequence. So sparkly, I love it. You know, if I was doing like altered art, that'd be such a pretty banner. Could cut that off and make a little banner out of that piece. Or actually you could use the whole thing and make a, wow, wouldn't that be a slamming looking banner? Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. Wow. Gorgeous. Mm, I love that. Okay, let's see what else we got here. Oh, I love these sheer laces to put, like, to cover my envelopes and stuff. It just makes, like, a really good background. Or even the cover of a journal. And then you would layer over that. I just, that's really pretty. I love the texture it gives. It's very pretty. Oh, look at that. I love this. Oh my gosh, it's so dainty. Oh my, I love that. Little pink and green trim. It's so cute. I need a ton of that. <laughs> I love that one. And this one is pretty too. Little flowers. Aren't they cute? That is so adorable. I love tiny trims. You can fit them into any project. And then here's some blue and green little flowers. So cute. You can cut these into little pieces. So pretty. Oh, look at that. That's like pale, pale pink. It's hard to see, but it is like the palest pink. Because see, if you put it against the white, you can kind of tell. Gorgeous. I love that shade. Oh my goodness, there's so many goodies in here. Oh, I love this. Little flowers. That's so cute. Love that. That is nice and soft. There. Oh, I love this little trim. It's so adorable. Is that the right side? Yeah. Isn't that so cute? Oh my goodness, I love that. I love the small laces, they're so pretty. Look at this, this looks vintage. I wonder if it is. Look at the stitching on that, it is so cool. Oh, I love that. 
Yes. Super pretty. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Ooh. Look at the beading on that boy. Wow. Look at that. It's a big flower. But you know me, I would be cutting all the little bits. So pretty. Look at the 3D on that. Can you see that? That is so cool. Oh, wow. Look at this. Look at the unique texture on that. Isn't that so cute? I can't tell if that's like a charcoal. It has a little bit of like a dusty purple color in it. I can't tell exactly, but it's really pretty. Okay, let's Oh, gosh, look at this. OMG, that is stunning. Sometimes, like when you see um, Esme do her lives, you can't really see how gorgeous some of these things are. But look at that. That is stunning. Love that. And OMG, this is gorgeous. Look at this one. Lots of beading on there. Wow, look how long that one is. Gorgeous. I mean, the flat, uh, I mean, the beads are like a clear. So pretty. Gosh, this box never ends. Oh, I love this kind of lace. It's so beautiful and dainty. Ah. Oh. I so want, this is like a white and I've never seen it in like this off white. I'm almost thinking I might avocado dye this. Gorgeous. Love that. Oh my goodness, you guys. Oh yes, I need to make a pillow out of these or something. Cause these are so cute. They're like a heart, big old heart. Aren't they cool? I guess you could cut it up if you weren't gonna make a project like that, maybe like a pillow or something. Oh, I love this. Look how dainty. Beautiful, I love that lace, gorgeous. And oh yes, look at this. Look at the texture on that. Like, you really have to get up close and see the texture on that. It's amazing. Gorgeous. <sighs> Love that. Oh, what a blessing box this is. <laughs> so amazing. Oh, that's sweet, too. You can put little trim in there. Little ribbon, very pretty. Whoa, look at this. Oh, and my gosh. Wow, look at the size of that. That is gorgeous. And the tool goes on for days. Beautiful. Wow. Thank you, Esme. That is a stunner. Wow, wow, wow. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And last but not least, look at this. This reminds me of like a nighty or something. <laughs> look how pretty that embroidery is. It's got like a touch of pink in it. Wow, that's beautiful. So soft. Satiny. That is gorgeous. Wow. Thank you, Esme, for this beautiful, beautiful box of goodies. I will leave Esme's information below. 
And you can check her out on Friday nights when she has her sales in the group. All the information is in the group for when her sales are. So all you have to do is join the group. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I can't believe all this fit in there. <laughs> I will talk to you again real soon. Bye for now.